Hi, I'm Chelsea Jordan and I'm a writer at Odiseo and this here is Frosty, who is one of our Liberty Arabians in the show. I just got lucky. I have always dreamt of being in this show and they had a casting call last year for North America and I sent a video and they called me. So it's like my wildest dream came true. <laughs> So I've been writing for 20 years. I was a 4-H kid for 10 years in Washington State and later as a teenager I got into dressage and more European disciplines. Um, but I didn't do horses professionally before this. I actually I went to school and got a couple degrees in international relations and environmental policy and worked abroad for a bit. And I was just on the job hunt and decided to chase this wild dream and it happened. So show days, as a writer I'll come in about 9 o'clock in the morning and I have three different horses that I specifically focus on. So I'll come in and take care of them and do various exercises to make sure that they're conditioned and happy and ready to do the show at night. And then throughout the day, so we'll finish the horses and then after that I'll do exercise um, for my own body and all of the riders will do that together. Uh, we'll have lunch and dinner and get hair and makeup done, maybe do some rehearsals and we'll do the show in the evening. They're the greatest people working here. It is the most passionate, energetic crowd. We all come from different backgrounds. We have over 13 different nationalities working here, all speaking different languages, different cultural backgrounds. We all come together to share the same passion, and that's horses. And then we put on the show together every night. So I've made irreplaceable, lifelong friends. Well, I'll try to do it. At long story short, uh, I've always been an athlete. I was a uh, ice hockey player for a really long time. And uh, I switched to um, to theater uh, throughout my my career, basically. And um, and uh, when I quit theater, I literally I found circus, and I was just mind blown by that. And I, it was literally mixing training and fitness with uh, all everything that it's with the art, basically, and performing. And uh, I wanted to do that so bad and I discovered finally the horses and this is where I just put it to another level and from now and then it's just it just become my job and uh, and the horses the horses become a, my real life basically we love to give back to families and stuff because it's a family show it's a show for everyone it's a show for four years old to 60 years old so when we got family thing like example the event that we've got today we really really love to do it and uh, it happens really often Oh, I mean, it, I've, I have so many memories, but one of them that I can really say it's the interaction that you've got with the audience. It's what you give to them. So um, there's one night I was doing a liberty act, and uh, my horse started getting really, really uh, into one of the one of the, the people in the audience. He started looking at it and being like, "Oh my god!" And it was a it was a little girl actually, and she was she was giving it a lot of attention and my horse react to her so fast and uh, every single time I was passing on the side of her she he was looking at it he was looking at her like this and it was it was brilliant it was beautiful and from now and at the end of my liberty I went super close to her and I gave her the opportunity to, to touch the horse and it was absolutely amazing because that was a priceless moment that I would never be able to have again. Yeah.